guys hope everyone's doing well going for my daily walk today is 20 degrees less hotter than it was a day ago it was 100 yesterday today is 80 degrees but I've been doing a series of getting back to basic business basic fundamentals selling basics so I want to share another topic with you that I would like to call that I am going to call the vehicle to growing your business and producing more sales. You see, the business is people, right? Because if you don't have people, you really don't have a business. And if you're not producing sales, you don't have a business because you can't hire people, right? So that's why I try to keep it simple, basic. There's a lot of derivative, there's a lot of creativity, but people, try to confuse things instead of making it simple because for me like one and one is two two and two is four right you can't change it it's the way it is so what i'm going to share with you today is the vehicle what is the vehicle now every business your business my business no matter what level of business is these four pillars i call it pillars equal the vehicle or the engine that drives the vehicle to growing your business okay so now here's here's the deal the deal is this the number one thing that you should focus on that I, I know I focus on and that we intend to take it lightly is the number one thing is getting qualified leads. That's the first pillar. You got to know who your audience is. You have to know where they're at. You have to know what makes them tick. And you have to know if your product and services is for them. Because your product and services may not be for every business, right? So you have to identify who your real target is audiences or what they call leads and prospects right does that make sense so that's number one once you identify who your qualified prospect is or who your qualified prospects are right and wherever they may be now the second thing is you have to have a really good effective productive efficient selling process most people call it sales process sales as you know is the end result of selling so i'm going to name it what it really is to me it's called the selling process for me i have a straight line method that i've been using for over 30 years that works unbelievable now there's a lot of things to the selling process okay but you have to understand you have to have a good selling process to be able to be more productive right now so that's number two the selling process now the third thing you need to have is sales people right now here's the thing about sales people if you don't have good leads and you don't have a good selling process then no matter how many sales people you hire you're not going to be successful as you can be. You're not going to be as productive as you can be. You're not going to produce as much sales as you should be. Because salespeople need to be trained in the right selling process. Does that make sense? So, you know, and in order to do that, you got to understand selling. You got to understand, you know, strategies. You have to understand all those things. So number three is having the right sales people the right sales team or this right selling team because they have to do the selling before they can produce the sales does that make sense 
So that's how I see things. Now, number four is this. It's the actual sales, right? Or oh, it's the actual converting those leads into sales, right? That's the vehicle. That's the gas. That's the engine. Does that make sense? So you got to remember, you got to know how to convert leads into sales. Because at the end of the day, you can have all the qualified leads you want. I know people that buy leads by the thousands and their contact ratio is very minuscule and then even their conversion ratio is even worse. You know what I mean? So you got to remember, you got to know how to sell. You have to know how to close. You have to know how to use the selling process and have good salespeople and teaching them how to convert those leads into sales, right? Because at the end, if you got great leads and you have great selling process, right? And let's say you have decent to average salespeople, you're not gonna produce a lot of sales if you don't know how to sell if you don't know how to close, if you don't know how to convert those leads into sales and convert those prospects into customers, right? So those are the four pillars of every business. Now, that's the vehicle. That's what I call the vehicle. In other words, that's the vehicle that leads you into the second part of the pillars, which has to do with revenue, uh, profits, uh, return on investment and cash flow. I'll get into that in the next video, but I'm doing a series of videos getting back to basic business and selling fundamentals. Because I think if you get back to basic selling fundamentals, you're going to be able to grow your business effectively, efficiently, and more importantly, you're going to have a lot of fun doing it, right? Anyway, that's my tip for today. I hope this has been helpful. Thank you for being part of the Paul Cruz Sales Agency. If you're watching this on YouTube, do me a favor. Hit the like button. Share your comments. Share your thoughts. And if you want to follow me, just hit the subscription button below. Till we speak again, I say goodbye. This is Paul Cruz with the Paul Cruz Sales Agency. Have a fantastic day. Bye.